Alright, another narrated battle, this time against Brains from YouTube. Uh, they challenged me to a battle, so yeah, I gladly accepted. And this was a really fun battle, actually, because I've seen a lot of Pokemon that I haven't seen before, especially used against me. Uh, so right away, as you can see, he's at a type disadvantage, so he switches out, and of course, I'm going to take advantage of that, and I Hypnosis... And his Mr. Mime is out of commission, which is good because who knows what he could baton pass. And so he goes to Bronzong, and I switch out to Lapras. But then I had a feeling that he's going to use Hypnosis, because Bronzongs tend to carry that. They usually start off with that. So I'm going to switch back to my Noctowl. And as predicted, he used Hypnosis. Brains used hypnosis and it didn't work because of insomnia. Now he brings Mr. Mime and Mr. Mime is out and air slash hit and missed the second time, which sucks. But I don't know why uh, they keep Mr. Mime in if they're asleep. It seems kind of odd. But uh, no matter because Mr. Mime is gone. Now it's Uixie's. Wait, no, no, not Uixie's. Me Spirit, yeah. That's the one, me spirit. So I'm just gonna stay in. He uses Stealth Rock. I used Mirror Move, and I <laughs> thought maybe I'd be able to copy Stealth Rock, but that only works on the Copycat move, not Mirror Move. So he uses Ice Beam, and I take that pretty well. And if you're wondering why, it's because well, Brains mentioned beforehand that he didn't fully, uh, they didn't fully EV train uh, their Pokemon. So, and uh, my Noctowl has some pretty good special defense, so that kind of plays into there. That's the reason why Ice Beam didn't kill it. So yeah, switch into Weevil, now he's trapped, so he switches and I use Pursuit, so that's a guaranteed KO right there. So now that Mii Spirit's out, now uh, Brains sends in Infernape, and... Ah, uh, man, this is gonna suck, because Infernape has the speed and power on its side, so obviously Weevil... Well, I just go for it anyway, hoping maybe I can KO it, but Brick Break hardly did a thing to Infernape. And so, yeah, we Weevil's gone. So I'm kind of, this is where I was feeling kind of uh, um, in a bind because I, I wasn't sure exactly what to do and uh, well I used Thunderbolt, I'm not sure why they switched out Infernape, maybe because they expected me to be faster or something, I don't know, maybe, anyway, uh, okay, Bronzong is gone, uh, thanks to Life Orb Magnet. Yeah, men, men at trick. And now it, this is <laughs> I loved this part. Bring in Victory Bell, but I surprised them with Overheat. And that just had some barbecue plant right there. <laughs> that was I loved that part so much. Alright, now it's back to Infernape. And I, uh... Well, I don't really have much to do at this point. I mean, because if I switch out... But I'm hoping he'll use a fighting attack. But no... They go for flamethrower and oh sh crap! Drifflin barely hangs in there, but he's grass knot and yes, I'm so happy. Uh, so I used shadow ball and it didn't take it out for some reason and I don't know why they used grass knot. Actually, I should have used flamethrower, but maybe expected a switch out or something. Or, I don't know to a water type. Room. But yeah, it would have been better to use flamethrower. But regardless, Drifflin is gone and uh, he's in. Their Infernape is almost gone. If I can just take it out. God, this thing is pissing me off. But yeah, back to Manectric. Uh, so I go for a quick attack, and I thought it would KO it, especially with Life Orb, but I guess not. And well, I weakened it, but at least I weakened it somewhat. But still, it just... Oh, so I'm like really in a bind, because I have like no idea what to do now. And the Stealth Rock, this damage, Flamethrower. So yeah, he gets a barbecued bird for lunch. Okay, now Lapras is my only hope. And they go for Grass Knot, and this is what scared me. Oh, but I hang in there, and I was so happy. So I just counter with Waterfall, and finally Infernape's gone. But I know that Blossom, yeah, is going to come out. And so I thought I was really, I thought I was screwed at this point. Expecting like something like Energy Ball, but they used Substitute, and while well, I took advantage of that, and I used Rest. Um... If you're wondering why they use Substitute, it's because, well, they only had Solar Beam, I think, as an attacking move, and, yeah, Sunny Day for Speed Boost, so I use Avalanche, which at least takes rid of the sub. Um, 
but Lapras is a really good special wall in this case, so um, but I'm hoping uh, so it can take a solar beam, but they, yeah, it, it takes it no problem, and Avalanche K KOs it, and yeah, whew, that was tough, and my other Pokemon was Golem, for those who want to know, so <laughs> as you can see, yeah, I would have been screwed if they had Energy Ball, no chance. But uh, yeah, it was a good, fun battle. Brains, uh, thanks for the challenge, and um, hopefully we can have a rematch sometime. All right, thanks for watching, everyone, and uh, peace out. Happy holidays.